How's it going bros? Today I have a tutorial on how to do gaming overlays or put your face up in the corner so that everyone else can see it. Coming up. Okay guys, so as you saw in the intro, we are going to show you how to do some face cam overlay on your gaming. So whether you're going to use this for something else, tutorials, or for gaming, this is how I'm going to show you it. So let's get right in. We're going to jump over to the computer with the face cam and we will see how to do it on one of my previous videos, the Happy Wheels 2 video with the face cam. You guys can jump back real quickly, link in the description to see that video and see the final with the face in the corner and just how it would look normally as if you would watch it on YouTube. Okay, so as we've jumped over to the uh, computer, you can see I'm in the edit tab with uh, we have our media pool over here with my face cam and my recording. So, remember, because your face cam is the overlay, you always want your face cam to be video 2. Therefore, we're going to pull our movie into video 1. Okay? So, now we have timeline 1, not a big deal. Okay. So, let's go back to my face cam. We're going to bring that in. Now you may notice my face cam is upside down, so I will go all the way back to the beginning and you guys can see that. If that happens for some reason with you, for some reason with DaVinci Resolve, mine likes to make my, I, my iPod camera upside down. I'm not exactly sure why, but not a big deal. We go into Inspector, oh yeah, we have to select, then you go down to Transform, and you hit, there's Flip Side, and we're going to flip this. Boom. So now it looks perfect, right? That's exactly what I did in the other one. Very easy. Looks as if it was normal. So, now you can see... So, as if you guys heard the 3, 2, 1 clap, that is because that's how I have a recording audio, which is really bad, so I don't use that audio. I use the camera audio. So, in order to sync it up so it doesn't look like I talk and then the thing happens, I start at the beginning with a three, two, one, and then a clap. The reason there's a clap is because a clap is a sharp noise that doesn't echo. So when you look into the audio waveforms, you can see in right there, the clap is a big spike. So it's easier to match up than normal talking. Now to match that up, this is very, you gotta know how to do this to make it so it doesn't, it looks good. Basically you just wanna match up this we can boom I think that's about good so we have a little bit of an echo but not much so it's a tiny bit of an echo but it's good enough that it will look real and it will sound real too wanna cut right there and we want to select select this delete it and it will in this case guys I'm gonna edit a lot of this out but, um, you guys might want to, uh, if you have troubles with it, just keep going back, keep editing and doing what you need to do in order for it to work and for it to look good. So I'm going to cut it right to where I say hey or hi or whatever my intro sounds like this time. So now you can just see my face, which is kind of annoying because you want to see it up in the corner. So we are going to click. This will also be in a basic edits video, which is coming out. So I'll show you guys how to do this for other picture on picture. So, we go to transform, crop, or dynamic zoom, we want transform, and we have that selected so you see the little things in the corner. When you select those, you can bring it in, and now you can see the overlay that's behind. So, so the video doesn't look too distorted, I would recommend bringing in your corners, or not corners, bringing in your sides a little bit, so that it looks more like a square, and it doesn't look as distorted. Uh, when you make it an overlay and that small little thing in the corner. So you bring it down, bring it down, bring it down till it looks good. On gaming, for instance, my face cam will be big on this one because you want to see my face. In some cases, you want this to be small so you can bring it down to a small size. It's way off in the corner back there and it's perfect. Now when we play through, we have almost perfect audio, and then what you can do is you can turn down this audio. Sounds perfect. Right? 
So then if we skip somewhere where I'm playing, this might spoil if you guys haven't seen the video, so go check that video out to make sure that it doesn't spoil anything. And see my face is up in the corner. Right? Boom. Right there. So very easy and very simple and intuitive to use. In some cases, I even see that, see how this is kind of on the wrong side is my original. Inspector. Watch. Select. Inspector. So we might want to flip it so it looks more na normal. But it's up to you guys. So that's the tutorial for today. It's a short tutorial. It's an easy one. Just make sure you guys do that 3, 2, 1 clap at the beginning so you can sync it up. So you got to wait 3, 2, 1 clap. Wait a second and then go right in so you know how to sync it up and that it looks perfect. That's how you guys get perfect overlay on your gaming audio. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to go watch that Happy Wheels video if you haven't already and go watch it again. Why not? It's an awesome video. Make sure that you guys click like and subscribe and comment. I allow any creators to comment their videos in my comment section so that other people that watch my videos can go down and see them. So that's a big thing. Make sure you guys do that. Have a great day, guys. Adios.